all programs, Dragon Naturally Speaking, Dragon Naturally Speaking Tools, and Acoustic and Language Model Optimizer Scheduler. Now, either way, it's going to open up a scheduler. Now, again, because it takes up so much of your computer's resources, we certainly recommend that you schedule it. Also, it's not recommended that you run the Acoustic and Language Model Optimizer until you've gathered a sufficient amount of information, of acoustic data. And the acoustic data is gathered from corrections and editing and training and performing an additional training. And again, for that reason, we recommend that you schedule it. So let's go back to our tools, Accuracy Center, and we will go to Schedule Acoustic and Language Model Optimizer. So this is the Acoustic and Language Model Optimizer Scheduler. So as you see here, let's resize some of these panes. There is the acoustic optimization task and the language model optimization task. So again, broken down into two different things. So if we want to schedule an acoustic and language model optimizer, we would go to File, New Task. So we're setting the system to create a new task, a schedule. Okay. A Windows username and password dialog box appears. Now the very first time you go to schedule the acoustic and language model optimizer, you are required to enter fully qualified Windows login information. So I will just type in my login password. Once I'm there, this wizard will allow me to select the frequency. Okay, How often do I want to run it? So my first option is username. I'm going to select the profile that I want to run this acoustic and language model optimizer. Now if you have multiple users under one, pro, under one uh, profile here, you would select multiple users. Otherwise, you can schedule each user as an individual task. Okay, dictation source. It's asking which dictation source do you want me to perform this acoustic and language model optimizer? So I will leave it by main profile, which is USB, or again, we can create a task for each dictation source. So again, because you're not supposed to run the acoustic and model optimizer until you've gathered a sufficient amount of data, the reason they break it down is because what if you use your USB microphone all the time? 